Welcome. And welcome to ITU Telecom World 2013 here in Bangkok. I have with me today the Director General of the Rwandan Regulator, Mr. Francois Regis Gatrayiha, who is going to talk to me a little bit about what's happening in that market. Welcome today, Director General. It's good to have you here. Good to see you. This, uh, this event is really all about embracing digital changes, in the, or embracing the digital world, in fact. Where do you see the biggest opportunities, particularly in terms of the changes for society? Well, the digital world is actually providing a lot of opportunities, uh, especially opportunities that come with the convergence of communications technologies. And with com convergence uh, comes the investment opportunities. For example, we don't have, uh, these days you cannot talk about a mobile phone that doesn't uh, do internet. Uh, you can watch a movie, you can watch a video on, on a mobile phone. And these come with better investment opportunities. What are the challenges that come with it, though? Yeah, with convergence, the challenges are huge as well in terms of uh, regulation, how to separate uh, the, the players in the market. Uh, we used to license differently, but now things have to change. Uh, so the regulators have to adapt to the convergence of technologies in terms of licensing as well. Do you have to, as a regulator, um, look at all the elements in that digital world and, and say, well, I can't regulate one and not regulate the other? Is it, is it easy to do that or do you have to change the way you, you look at regulation across the board? We definitely have to change the way we look at regulation. We have to embrace the changes and we have to make sure that we don't create any bottlenecks for creativity, innovation that comes with the convergence of technologies. So our, our entire regulations have to be changed. What do you think are the biggest benefits for your own country? I mean, in Rwanda, moving from virtually a, a fixed line environment into mobile and now moving into the mobile broadband world with the announcement from China Mobile, what do you see the changes, what will, what will occur in Rwanda? What will be the dramatic changes that you'll see? Well, we've already started seeing uh, a lot of improvements in the way people do businesses, in the way the kids are just inter you know, interested in using a lot of internet, and the government has seen this opportunity and we are already looking at a number of services. Uh, the government is providing about a thousand services online. So these have to be Im implemented and accessed through internet and uh, broadband. Wow. Now, for yourself, what has been the biggest thing that you've experienced at this particular event? What are the benefits you've got from coming to ITU Telecom World? Well, ITU Telecom World 2013 was a very good platform for us to exchange views and uh, see the, improve, the technologies and how other countries are approaching the implementation of the new broadband uh, technologies and big data. So it has been a very, very, very good experience for us. Well, it's been a great pleasure having you here today. Thank you for spending time with me. Thanks for having me.